Hi, Ian Mayer Marzelic, Senior National Corporate Trainer for Schwarzkopf Professional USA. Today I'm going to be showing you a technique that is great for uh, volumin voluminous and uh, textured and curly hair. Uh, it's called dappling, you've heard it called hand painting, where essentially we're going to be scrunching uh, lightener into the outsides of the hair. Today we're going to be using our Blond Me Bond Enforcing Premium Lightener 9 Plus with our 6% 20 volume developer uh, to make sure that we're getting the maximum lift possible. So let's get started. All right, before we get started in this technique, uh, if your client has curly hair, but you, you're really kind of trying to focus on the outside, so you want to expand the hair as much as possible, um, what I'm going to use today is our Osis Texture Craft. It is a, um, a dry texture spray, and really all I'm going to do is just kind of shake the can, lift, shake the can, lift, so I can get as much volume as possible out of this hair. So now if you look, it'll be easier for me to grab um, and apply my lightener. Okay, to make things easier for myself, uh, I like to section the hair into three sections um, just so that I can focus on each area at a time. So I basically took from uh, above the occipital down, um, this middle section in through here, and then just the very top. Um, I'm gonna start from the bottom up, working my way up. Um, and I'm just gonna basically scrunch the lightener in and I'll show you. All right, go ahead and unclip your bottom section. Uh, here's a tip. If your client has tighter textured curls, you probably won't need to section um, the hair out as it's, it's, it kind of stands on its own even more. Um, but again, you just wanna take out this bottom section and then really the technique is quite simple. You put some lightener onto the palms of your hands, just like this. And I keep, I keep one clean hand. And basically what you do is you lift and you grab the outsides of the hair, just like this, so that you're getting the surface of the hair. And you just keep doing this depending on how much lightness you wanna see on the ends. So I'm gonna give it another go. So I have seen this technique done as well. Um, instead of using your hand as the uh, highlighting tool, I've seen people put lightener on the back of foil and then just essentially kind of uh, shoe shine, if you will, on the outer surface of the hair. Tip, uh, if you use a foil to spread the lightener, that is better for tighter textures and tighter curl patterns, I would say from like uh, in the fours at 4 ABC or uh, tightly, tightly curled, coiled, zigzag textures, um, because this hair uh, is just a little too um, loose and you're not gonna get the concentration that you're looking for. You can lift up the hair and literally just like kind of make a money piece, if you will, and just gently hand paint with your fingers around the face to get more lightness and concentration around the face. And then we've got all of this beautiful highlighting happening on the ends. Very excited to show you the end result. Okay, you can see we've got our final and finished look from our dappling technique, surface painting, remembering the hair uh, is just kind of a shape when it's curly and it's brushed out. Uh, so we were focusing on adding lightness uh, on the outside of the hair not so much focusing anything towards the inside. Uh, we did create a very slight money piece and I'm gonna bring my girl up to you so you can see. We've got some very subtle and very soft face framing. Um, but as you can see on the rest of the hair, it's just this beautiful, soft kind of golden caramel highlights that are just on the surface. Obviously her hair has been uh, I let it air dry and just kind of ran some Osis magic through it uh, just to give it a really nice shine. But you can see here, uh, it's just really soft and subtle and gorgeous, uh, especially for curly hair once it's back in its normal state. So I hope you liked 
Hope you like this highlighting technique. Uh, let us know what you think. Thanks.